YouTubers, welcome back to my channel. I thought I'd do a quick video today about how I clean dog food bowls and water bowls. Uh, Non-toxic, no chemicals, no additive scents, fragrance, anything like that. Just something to keep them clean because they can get pretty gnarly and crusty with slobber and just water stain in the bowl a lot, sometimes mold form, stuff like this. So I will give you a quick tutorial on how I do this. All right, let's keep watching. I have all of the three dog food and water bowls in our laundry room. So I take the bowls out, I put it in the sink in the laundry room and pull out just plain baking soda. I get this huge super sized bag at Costco at a discount. I simply sprinkle that into the bottom of the bowl, a little bit on the sides. Not too much, I don't measure this, I just kind of eyeball an amount. And then I sprinkle some vinegar in there and I let that sit for just a second. You can use any type of vinegar. I can't remember where I picked up this brand, but it does not matter what brand of vinegar you use. And then any old scrub brush that you have, I dedicate this one to the dog food and water bowls so it's not cross contaminated with any chemicals or anything like that. And then I just scrub and scrub and scrub. I'll spin the bowl around and I'll get all the entire bottom of the bowl and then I will get up on the sides and then along the rim. Sometimes in the water bowl there will be uh, some water stains that get some on the side. Um, the dog food bowls don't really get too dirty. It kind of depends on whose bowl it is. Um, some of the pups tend to slobber a little bit more than other pups and so one bowl might be a little bit more crusty than another bowl but sometimes it will take doing this twice. I will rinse it out once and then dump it and then if it looks like it needs a little bit more then I'll go back and you can always do a repeat two, three, four times, however much it takes. But rinse it really good so there's no residue left, uh, there's no baking soda, there's no vinegar. If the dogs were to ingest either of these products it would not be toxic to them but it's best to get a good rinse and then you're good to go. And they're nice and shiny, almost like brand new bowls. So if you liked this video and you'd like to see more content, please give this a like, a share, a thumbs up, and thank you so much for watching. See you next time.